only one more ingredient was missing. A bone mushroom to flavor the brew. I should just forget about the mushroom and just make the brew taste like a sweaty foot to teach that wolf a lesson. No, please. <sighs> okay.
not going to be easy for Little Red Mavis because there were... Don't tell me. Loads of enemies, right? <laughs> Okay, Drac, because you've read it wrong. It's not like that.
I think you might have the wrong book, because that's not what happened. because that can't be possible. Bravely defeating all the enemies, Little Red Mavis finally reached the only place in the marsh where the juiciest bone mushrooms grew. A craggy place full of dangers, with ravines where one false step could be fatal. Really? Ugh. And all this for a cake. No, no, no. It didn't go that way. And that card looks very, very handsome. We got every card in this chapter. We make a great team. Great determination and a tired body from her dangerous trip, Little Red Mavis managed to find the rare, enormous bone mushroom that only grew once every ten years. Okay, there it is. I just need to pick a small bone from the mushroom, and this disaster will be over. What was that? Oh no, that sound isn't part of the story. What are you doing here, Dinkles? Did you eat your leash again? He's hungry, Papa Drac. 
Look out, Little Red Mavis! No, bad dog. Now, Little Red Mavis would have to give Tinkle some bones before he devoured the last bone mushroom of the decade.
and with the last ingredient found, Little Red Mavis returned home to repair the brew and finally cure the wolf's tummy ache.